Today, I visited an EU restaurant that has been established for 50 years. White grilled eels without seasoning and liver skewers are the most popular here at this restaurant. You can't make the good white grilled unless you have good eels. Eel liver skewers is such a valuable food that's on the menu at this restaurant as it requires two or three eels at least. How the eel gets dressed is quite different from Eastern and Western Japan. Whereas in Eastern Japan, it's belly down. We have various theories for this. However, in Edo period, there were many samurais that lived in Eastern Japan. Especially back then, belly up, which reminded samurais of seppuku, was thought to be a bad omen. Therefore, the belly down serving style has become the mainstream. On the other hand, in Western Japan, where the merchant culture has been heavily eroded, there is an interesting saying the people there talking frankly with each other would prefer belly open. Talking frankly with each other with one's belly open means that you reveal your true feelings. Although Japanese culture has this tendency of hiding emotions inside. This means that your heart gets exposed without hiding anything in your mind. Seppuku, also known as Harakiri, was an honorable way of dying for samurais. Also, the cooking style in Eastern Japan and Western is different. Eels in Kanto area, which is the Eastern Japan, are grilled over the charcoal and then they get steamed ones so that they go plump up then dipped in the sauce and they get grilled again on the contrary eels in Kansa area which is western Japan do not get steamed and yet baked to soften the meat originally the best season of eels is winter, as they get fatter with more oil on them. But in Japan, it has been said that eating eels in summertime is good for some weight loss since the ancient times. According to one theory, in the late 1700s, in the Edo period, Gennai Hiraga, a scholar of Dutch studies, that was one day consulted by an eel restaurant owner, claiming that the sales go down drastically in summertime. And then, this Gennai Hiraga recommended that the restaurant owner put a sign, saying that today is the day of ox. Ox is one of the 12 signs of Chinese zodiac that has been used to describe time, year, date, month, and so forth. And so, they decided to make the day of ox, the day of the eels. If you eat them, you'll be able to beat the summer heat fatigue. This tactic became so successful that the other eel shops started to copy the same business model. This today is the day of ox is said to be the very first copywriting in Japan. Japanese food has lots of history behind it. Good man inside did everything that you thought you should. Did it seem to do you any good? Here they come. It's not so fragrant. The 
aroma of sunshine drifts into the warm steam of the eel. Soft eel and this sauce go really well with some rice. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.